come and study with Tanzania Institute of Education. Some reactions such as fermentation or rusting take long time. Others such as precipitation take a fraction of seconds. It is important to know how fast you can get the product of a chemical reaction. The rate of chemical reaction increases with an increase in temperature. The increase in temperature increases the kinetic energy of reacting particles, thus increase the chances of frequency of effective collision between the reacting particles. The aim of this experiment is to investigate the effect of temperature on the rate of chemical reaction. Requirements. Five conical flasks, two measuring cylinder, stopwatch, thermometer, tripod stand, wire gauze, and heat source. Chemicals, one molar hydrochloric acid, 0 0.05 molar sodium thiosulfate. Procedure. Label conical flasks with the letter A, letter B, letter C, letter D, and the letter A, letter E. Measure 50 milliliters of sodium thiosulfate solution into each of the five flasks. Transfer sodium sulfate into conical flask A. Transfer sodium thiosulfate into conical flask B. Transfer sodium thiosulfate into conical flask C. Draw a cross on a piece of paper. Place conical flask A on a piece of paper, mark D, X. Add 10 ml of hydrochloric acid solution. Immediately start the stopwatch. Look into the mixture. Look into the mixture from above and note the time it takes for the cross to disappear. 
The time taken for the cross to disappear is 346 seconds. For conical flask B, warm the sodium thiosulfate to 30 degrees centigrade. Place the conical flask on your paper mark the X. Sodium thiosulfate solution in conical flask B is 30 degrees centigrade. Take 10 ml of hydrochloric acid. into a conical flask B while starting the stopwatch. Look into the conical flask to observe the disappearance of a mark. Stop the clock when the mark disappears. The time taken for the cross to disappear is 215 seconds. Then, for because C, Repeat the same procedure by warming the sodium thiosulfate into the conical flask C to 40 degree centigrade. The time taken for the close to disappear in conical flask C is 67 seconds. The time taken for close to disappear in conical flask D is 31 seconds. Heat the solution in conical E to 60, 60 degree centigrade. Take the conical flask E on a piece of paper mark D X. Take 10 ml of hydrochloric acid into conical flask E and immediately start the stop clock. Look into the conical flask. Immediately stop the clock when the clothes disappear. And the time taken for the clothes to disappear is 20 seconds. From table of results, draw the graph of temperature against time in seconds. And also draw the graph of temperature against time inverse.
The sketchy graph of temperature against time is parabolic in nature. That is, increase in temperature decreases the time for the reaction to complete. The sketchy graph of temperature against time inverse, as temperature increases, the rate of chemical reaction increases. Diluted dichloric acid reacts with the sodium thiosulfate to give sulfur, sodium chloride, water and sulfur dioxide. It is the fine particles of sulfur that makes the reaction mixture turns cloudy. The cross disappears when a certain amount of sulfur is formed. This amount is equal in all reactions. The graph of temperature against time is a parabolic curve. This shows that the time it takes for the cross to disappear decreases with an increase in temperature. Therefore, the rate of chemical reaction increases with the increase in the temperature.